Philippine military aircraft. I'm warning you again. Leave immediately. All you will spare for what? What you just heard was China bullying the Philippines to leave a territory Filipinos partly claim to be theirs in the South China Sea. And I need you right now to keep watching because China could soon start something that can affect the entire world if America fails to stop them in their tracks. A Chinese Coast Guard vessel is seen forcefully taking a suspected rocket debris retrieved by Philippine Navy personnel. Now, the Philippine Coast Guard has removed a floating barrier installed by China. What could be the reason why just in the past months Chinese ships were caught on camera temporarily blinding Filipino crew members with military-grade laser lights, shamelessly firing water cannons at the ships of the Philippine Coast Guard? <laughs> and even attempting to block or sometimes collide with Philippine boats like this. What is China planning this time? The Chinese Coast Guard vessel has been shadowing us for a while now at one point, sailing as close as six meters to this vessel. And let me tell you, this is not just an Asia problem. China wanting to control 90% of the South China Sea represents world domination because whoever controls this very crucial body of water effectively controls a huge chunk of the world one third of the world's marine trade 12 percent of the world's fisheries and an estimated 11 billion barrels of oil all of these riches can be found in the controversial south china sea and while smaller countries in this area like taiwan brunei malaysia vietnam indonesia and the philippines defend their individual claims just to provide livelihood to their fishermen and enough food and materials for their people. The senators condemned what they call China's bullying in the West Philippine Sea. China is shamelessly claiming almost all of it, while using an imaginary line already rejected by international court for having no legal basis. The nine dash line. Literally nine imaginary dashes drawn around the map of the South China Sea that China says they back to the 15th century and just recently they even updated their map to add an extra dash that includes another island they've been claiming all this time Taiwan and unfortunately for the countries China is bullying they're not just good at claiming things with conviction they also put their money where their propaganda is. That's why for the past two decades, China has been aggressively building man-made islands in South China Sea and then putting up aircraft hangars, runways and missile facilities as if preparing for something sinister. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine vehicles moving. Except in their grand plan to take over Taiwan, there's another country on the map strategically placed to get in their way, the Philippines. In the first place, we don't even have to ask for their permission. They may not have the same huge equipment, but the Filipinos are standing their ground. Just look at this Filipino guy simply cutting with a knife the barriers that China put in Philippines' own waters. The freaking island is literally next to the island of Palawan and they call it China's property? In fact, this rusty ship you see here in the Spratly Islands was grounded on purpose by the Philippines just to send the message this has always been and will always be ours. China out of Philippine waters! China out of Philippine waters! This obviously is a headache for China. They want this symbolic ship removed so much, they're even blocking Filipinos from sending supplies there. Which explains the bullying we showed you earlier. But as you can see, this ship is rusting away. And this symbol of resistance could soon collapse and leave this disputed shoal unoccupied. Here, ladies and gentlemen, is where the USA comes in and the Philippines 
unfortunately needs them. We interrupt this program. Night fam, are you looking for fun gifts for your loved ones? Cause you only have a few days left to buy our clever Christmas gift collection, which is guaranteed to make people smile. Make it rain. Don't be Rudolph. Never slay. Never. Tree Rex. Up to snow good. Respect the beard. Season's greetings. It's the most wonderful time of the year. And all these cool mouse pads are guaranteed to make your loved ones smile when they open your gift. Wherever you live, we ship worldwide. So go visit our shop right now at honesty.global to get it before Christmas. And in the beautiful Christmas spirit of giving, all profits made from this collection will go to support our charity so you can also end your year with a good deed buy it for your loved ones or for yourself whatever you want just please never slay never now back to the video just this year, the Philippines allowed the US to open four more military sites to continue training their militaries together. The United States defense commitment to the Philippines is ironclad. Because right now it's the US making symbolic moves to tell China no bully can simply claim international waters whenever they want. And while some Filipinos rightly think this could just be another trap for the Philippines to rely again on its former colonizer, well, what do you do when you're stuck in a brewing war between two superpowers? One who is shamelessly telling you to leave your own territory. Baby military airport. I'm warning you again. And another who, for their own reasons, is helping you defend it. We will come to the aid of the Philippines if they're attacked. Knowing that USA imports 90% of its microchips from Taiwan, they obviously got their own skin in the game. You don't know who is the print. So, will China's continuous harassment of the Philippines become a final bait for the United States to go head to head with China? feel so sorry for the peace-loving people of the Philippines. The arms race and power struggle of the powerful nations is destroying the smaller nations and the world. Only time will tell what happens next, between this bully chasing more and more power and the bullied just defending its home. Are you worried about a potential war between the US and China? Of course, we will be caught in the middle. And it might just be one accident away from blowing up into something dangerously bigger. So Night Fam, please share this video so the world keeps its eyes on China. Leave immediately and keep our own to avoid any misunderstanding.